Hey everybody, welcome back to Matt's Ice Cream Show. We are back on our quest to try all the ice cream world has to offer. Welcome back to Matt's Ice Cream Show, everybody. Today we're going to be doing for the fat, fat, uh, for the larger, big boned individuals. No, JK. Um, we're going to be doing Weight Watchers Giant Chocolate Fudge, a chocolate low fat ice cream. So, uh, the reason why I was joking, of course, about the fat fatties, because I'm a fat fatty, but in reality, uh, some of you are, you know, on diets, watching your weight, watching your health, vegan, uh, lactose intolerant, etc. And the goal of this show is to try all the ice cream world has to offer to include frozen dairy desserts, light ice cream, frozen custard, gelato, etc., the whole ice cream world, and maybe even a few things that aren't quite ice cream, but we'll let it go, like little fruit bars and stuff like that. But anywho, let's go ahead and jump into it. For the calorie conscious crowd, this is one serving. Each bar is one serving of 90 calories, nine zero calories. And this has, let's see, made with low-fat milk. The back says, we believe that wellness can fit into everyone's life. We're here to inspire you with practical tools, a supportive community, foods you'll love, so you can build a helpful habits that last. Weight Watchers ice cream are sweet, smooth, and refreshing. I'll be the judge of that. Who's had these before? Put it in the comments below. Also, while you're there, make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Welcome new fans, and of course, welcome old fans. So this is, you know, as you can see, those ice crystals, unfortunately, been unfrozen and frozen and refrozen. It's kind of annoying, but anywho, unfrozen, frozen. I'm sorry, frozen, unfrozen, and refrozen, which takes away from the quality. But let's go ahead and jump into it. Well, first things first, which is a bit surprising to me. I was expecting just this to be like a cold chocolate bar. It's a very creamy texture. That's not half bad. Maybe not. You guys see how it's like, you, the outside looks all frozen, like, you know, almost like a hard rock. The outside, or the inside as you go, it almost like melts in your mouth. Obviously ice cream, but I'm saying like sometimes with these type bars, they're a little bit more rigid. And this has a very nice, it really does have a nice smoothness to it. This is surprisingly good. I'm not going to lie. Mm. Nice chocolate to it. Like a good milk chocolate taste to it. Doesn't taste super um, like you know fake sugars. It has a uh, obviously I wouldn't say it was organic, but it, it has a less um, high fructose corn syrup taste and a more organic sugar taste. Well, they, they use corn syrup, but I'll admit... No, they did use a little bit of sugar. Okay. Okay, so, yeah, they used a little bit of both. Because I was going to say, like... Usually with a high fructose corn syrup taste... You, <clears throat> you can kind of... I don't know. It's just... It's, it has a, speci a very specific taste to me. And a lot of times, if you're eating... Because I've had so much ice cream. You can kind of taste the difference. But... This definitely has a more natural sugar taste to it. This is surprisingly good. And I say surprising because it is lower fat, lower calories, Weight Watchers type stuff. Interesting. Okay, scale of 1 to 100, 10 point grading scale. Hmm. I'd actually eat these outside of this show. In fact, I might eat some of this tonight. Um, let's see. Scale of 1 to 100, 10 point grading scale. For what it is, which is a, a low fat, you know, diety type dessert. I might give like a 95. So let's go like a solid A. 96, 95, 96. I would say my only real discrepancy is I wish it was a little bit sweeter and maybe a little bit more chocolatey. But other than that, like it's got a good fat content to it for what it is. Excellent creaminess to it, nice and smooth, like a denser, almost reminiscent in some ways 
of maybe like a Hagen Dawes, as far as the texture goes. Um, the chocolate is pretty good for like, especially for a uh, you know d more diet thing. Like th they actually got the chocolate really, really good in my opinion. Overall, this is a winner through and through. I, I, I like this. I, I recommend this. You guys go out and check it out. Let me know what you think. Put it in the comments below. Let me know if you know any other brands that have something similar. Maybe I can compare them. Also, while you're there, lights. What do you think about last night's stream? I thought it was pretty good. I say that often because of a regional or seasonal or limited edition. You guys go out and check out the, the other ice creams. I have trouble finding them sometimes. Love talking to you guys in the comments of old videos. Uh, if you guys can find them. Love talking to you in the comments of these videos. Party of Matt's Ice Cream Show comment section. Um, like I said, Weight Watchers Giant Chocolate Fudge. This is a winner through and through. I recommend this one. You guys go out and check it out. Let me know what you think. If you get a chance to try it, put it in the comments below. Thank you so much for tuning in. Tell your friends, tell your family. Check the links below. Um, if you're not here, subscribe, please subscribe. I don't think you'll be disappointed in this. The Weight Watchers Chocolate Fudge Bars definitely has a good chocolatiness to it, sweetness to it, and in general, it's an overall winner. I recommend it. I'm going to shut up now, and I will see you next time. See you next time, guys. Thank you.